What is up, everyone? Happy Friday. It is Friday, July 7th, 2023. And uh, I don't think I've ever done this before. Uh, for today, $1 of <laughs> profits. So started off with a Roblox uh, upside volume runner that was awesome. 412 and then Boeing plus 75. Baidu was a small loser, minus 30. Uh, and then this one's the one that hurt me, and I tried to be patient with it. And if I would have waited a little bit longer, I would have turned this into a definite green day and got a lot of this back. I'll show you that here in a second. And then a mighty 90, um, an Apple that was minus eight dollars. So uh, let's take a let's take a look. So first off, Roblox had this big volume bar, and uh, Pull back a little bit. Um, actually, I think I got in right here on this pullback and then it popped up and I wrote it up. And then um, I had four remaining contracts. I sat through all of this pullback. And then when it popped up to here, I just got out of the rest of them. So nice winner there. Um, Boeing had a big volume bar right here on this pullback. Actually, I think it, I think when it pulled back here, um, I got long somewhere in here um, and then got out of half and then it came back down and I ended up cutting it right here because it just wasn't doing what it's uh, a volume runner was supposed to do. And you can see it just chopped forever. So small winner there. Baidu had a big volume bar here. So it pulled back um, and then uh, uh, after this pullback, I got in, it kind of came up a little bit came back down and then I just got out of it before it flushed here. So I ended up being a pretty much a scratch trade, just minus 30 bucks. Square was the disappointing one. I mean, it had all these big volume bars and when it pulled back here, I went ahead and got long. Maybe I should have waited longer. Um, and it came down here and I added to it down here and it popped up and then it just, I, I was patient with it and, I really wasn't doing what a continuation runner is supposed to do. So it looked like it was going to continue lower right here. So I got out right here. You can see what's happened. It is now coming back. If I would have waited until the close of this bar, I think I got out with like a minute left in the bar. And then it started to come back up. And then it's, you know, it's since pushed up. So I probably would have been out of half my ad by now. And it would have been a nice, I would have turned in a better green day than $1 if I would have hung on to this, but you know, I mean, whether you play this as a volume runner or a continuation runner on a little three bar pullback here, it had more than three bars and just kind of lost patience with it. Apple finally took this towards the end, uh, had a mighty 90. Let's see right here. It came down. That's Microsoft. Here it is. Here's Apple. So it had this nice volume pop right here. So I got long right here and then it, came down more so i added to it here then it pushed up and i got out of half right up here and uh ended up just closing it out right here after this bar you can see it ran up more but i got two green bars and then got a little more back here and just closed the rest of it out so um that was today so for the week three days of trading uh Nice day in three days, $2,626 on 13 trades, nine winners, four losers, almost 70%. So Mighty 90s were two and one, volume runners four and two, nice volume runners in continuation three and one. So I'll take this plus uh, 2626 for three days of trading. And uh, I will see everybody back on Tuesday of next week. Have a great weekend. Peace.